Hi, I'm Sean Gannett, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about multiplying radical expressions. So if I was given this expression, 5 minus 4 square root of 5 times negative 2 plus the square root of 5. So what I want to do is take all parts of my first parenthesis and multiply by all parts of my second parenthesis. So let's do that. 5 times a minus 2 is a minus 10. 5 times the square root of 5 is just 5 square root of 5. Minus 4 square root of 5 times the minus 2. Two negatives make a positive, so we have a positive. 2 times 4, or 4 times 2 is 8. Square root of 5 here. And then minus 4 times the uh, square root of 5 times the square root of 5 is just a minus 4 square root of 5 times 5. We can combine the square roots into 1. All right, 1 big square root, multiplication, and the 4 is just on the outside. So now we can simplify a little bit. We have a negative 10 is right there. Uh, but now we both have square roots of 5s right there. So we can combine these two, look at the numbers out front. 5 plus 8 is a uh, 13. So we have 13 square root of 5 here. Okay. Minus, well, we have a pair of 5s right there. So the pair brings the individual to the outside. Okay. And that's uh, 4 times that 5. And then the square root gets eliminated. Okay. So we can simplify this a little more. We have a negative 10 here plus 13 square root of 5. And then 4 times 5 is. 20. Okay, so we have minus 20 right there. We can combine that with a minus 10 to be minus 30. And so we have minus 30 plus 13 square root 5, and that is our final answer. So let's recap. We're having 5 minus 4 square root of 5 times negative 2 plus the square root of 5. We can distribute that across uh, all parts of my first parenthesis times all parts of my second parenthesis, and that gave us this the negative 10 plus 5 square root of 5 plus 8 square root of 5 minus 4 times the square root of 5 times 5. Simplify that, combine these two to get 13 square root of 5, and this pair here brought the 4 times, uh, brought the 5 outside to have it just as 4 times 5. 4 times 5 was 20. Then we combined, or then we have the minus 20 here and the minus 10 to combine them together to give us our final answer of a minus 30 plus 13 square root of 5. 